Hi guys, this is Bobby with BC Designs and I'm going to share another cute card with you guys today. This is one of my favorite designs, like layout for a card. I do it a lot, I know. Um, I'm going to use the Charming Duck Pond and the dies, but today we're not using the dies. I just wanted to show them to you. There are 15 dies in this bundle and they are simply amazing. I used this stamp set for my June card club projects and I absolutely loved them. So I'm using the um, six by six paper pack that is the Lily Pond Lane six by six paper pack. Let me just slide that back in there. Mine's been greatly loved and used. So we're not using the dies, like I just said, it's just a simple kind of, I guess you could call it a fun fold card. So we'll go ahead and do our stamping really quick. And on the inside, I'm just going to stamp, uh, have a lovely day. And we're just going to stamp it right in the center, like that. And then the sentiment for the front, I used basic white and the stylus shape dies to cut that out. And we'll just stamp that right in the center, like so. Okay. And then we'll just move this out of the way, and then I can tell you some measurements. So for your card base, you're going to cut it four and a quarter by eleven and score it at five and a half. And then you're just going to cut away two and three quarters. So you're just going to cut that, and then that's we're going to put it right there. And then the DSP, this piece is two and a quarter by four and this piece also is a two and a quarter by four and then the strip on the inside is three quarters by four so we'll go ahead and start putting this together I can, i'm trying not to when i have to reach for stuff i have to try to make sure that my head does not hit my camera so we're just going to put that down and then we'll put some adhesive on the back this is such a cute stamp set. Everybody is loving it. And right now, you guys can shop and get the extra 10% off and make it even cheaper. Let's go ahead and put this piece down right there on the front. And we'll just put that. And you could change these colors if you wanted it to be more of a masculine card. So they're not so like flowery and girly looking. Just like that. And then you're gonna put, let me see if I put dimensionals. Nope, I just put adhesive. So on this side, the left hand side, I'm actually gonna use the seal plus because this is gonna be the flap that gets opened quite a bit. So we'll just make sure that we have some good strong adhesive on there. And you just kind of put it really wherever you want it to open and fall. And then let's put some dimensionals on the back of the label for the sentiment. I have got to check my memento black because I'm getting ink and I think there has to be ink on here because I keep getting ink on my hands and it's every single time I touch that pad. Okay, and then we'll just put this right in the center like that. And let's grab one of these little dots and we'll put it right there and then I'm going to grab a new blue dot and we'll put it right about there and then we'll grab our linen thread I'm going to make a double bow, so I'm just going to double, let's pull it up, I want a little bit more, I don't feel like that is enough. So let's see, that one is probably good. So we'll just cut that, and then we'll cut it again, right there at that end. And then we'll make a cute bow, and this card will be done. How quick Painless and easy was this card to make. Very. This might be the my quickest YouTube video in history. 
but I'm just going to look and see. That looks pretty good. Let's kind of pull these together and we'll give them a trim. We'll give them that one so we kind of get the same amount cut off. Pop it right on that little glue dot. And you guys, that card is done. What do you think? How quick and easy was that? So if you want to mass produce, there you go. You, This is the card for you. Thanks so much for stopping by, guys. If you're not already subscribed, please subscribe to my channel. I appreciate you guys so much. Bye-bye.